All right, hey everyone, Dogen here. So everyone knows that Japanese convenience stores are incredible, amazing, awesome. So I wanted to take this opportunity to show you guys what I got at my Japanese convenience store haul earlier today. Let's get into it. Okay, so this is the first thing, Band-Aids. I cut my finger earlier today. I was uh, trying to cut some carrots. There we go. And I just think that it's amazing that you can get something, you know, to fix yourself up at a moment's notice in Japan. I mean. It's great. It's one of the reasons I love Japan. I got one of these uh, egg sandwiches. Japanese people have these all the time. I've never actually had one of these egg sandwiches before. Let, let's try it out. Oh my God. Oh my God, that is so good. Man, Japan coming through in the clutch. This is why I really love Japan. Not only is this like amazing and it was like a dollar, which is crazy, but on top of that, I mean like Japan is known for being extremely healthy. I'm sure if I have this, you know, like every day, maybe even like two, that's gonna be way better than the alternative back home, which was like oatmeal and blueberries or whatever. So <laughs> love Japan. Not worried about, you know, any potential health ramifications. All right, now let's um, try some of this tea. It says hojicha, ho hojicha, roasted green tea. Oh man, that smells so good. Mmm. Mm. Guys, it's got like that Japanese like um, aroma. Even if there are any like potential downsides to those foods I was eating earlier, I'm sure there, there aren't, but if, even if there were, you know, like this roasted green tea, this is like drinking like medicines. There's been some studies that show that it like, it'll bring your age back by like 10 or 15 years, I think is what it said. I mean, and it makes sense because it's, wow. Okay, Um, the design of this like bottle, I mean, it's so like, you know, refined and like, it's got like this playful character to it. It's so much different from like, you know, the stuff back, you know, Coca-Cola. It's like, come on, man. Like, you know, try a little bit harder. Get, learn from um, Itoen. You really feel like the craftsmanship that they put into this. All right, so the next item is um, these socks, which I also got from the convenience store. Is it, you know, like a place where you get like magazines and like maybe a couple snacks, or is it like a full on apparel shop? The best of both worlds. I can't read all these kanji, but let me open it up and see how these feel. Oh, it's got like the stretch action going on. Oh, I love that. I love that. I'm gonna put these on. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, those those feel good. That, that oh man. I bet it's like some Japanese, like traditional, like um, sewing technique. I cannot go back to the States. Like I'm so used to all this incredible stuff. Socks, band-aids. Come on. I also got one of these um, protein in protein packs, a special jelly drink designed to supply protein as more easily absorbed peptides for supporting your daily exercise to improve your physical condition. I'm not sure 100% what all of that means. I love the action pack. Okay, <laughs> okay. Yeah, again, like it's incredible that something this, like it, uh, like a health product can taste this good. Man, I wish I could read these cons in Japan. Love Japan. Okay, so this I'm really excited for. I got some um, Bam Kuhen. Uh, I've actually got some German blood. I don't think that most of the viewers know this, but as someone with German blood, I'm kind of like an authority on this kind of thing. Oh man, the smell, they nailed the smell. This is like so, so much like the real thing back in the States. Here we go. Oh my God. Okay, I need to like take a moment here. <laughs> this is better than the real thing. I can't believe I'm saying this, but oh my God. Everything I've tried today too, you know, it's like the Band-Aid just works. The socks, super comfortable. The protein pack, I mean, if I had had that in high school and I was doing martial arts, I probably could have easily gotten like, you know, like a black belt three months earlier. All right, so I've got a couple more food items. Let's check these out. A peanut butter sandwich, but it's crazy because it's like you can't even, well, I'll just show you guys. I'm not sure how to describe this, but the bread has no crust. Mmm. Mmm. Okay, okay. It's like clearly a, a Japanese peanut. Again, I can't read, I can't read all of the kanji, but I love how like I don't have to worry about, like I don't have to feel guilty for eating this because you know, Japan, again, is known for being such a healthy country. I see Japanese people eating these and they live forever. This, I'm not worried right now whether or not, you know, my, my blood sugar levels are, are spiking. Love Japan. I feel like I could eat like 10 of these and just still keep going. I saw this and I just thought this was like so cool. You know, 
just like a little little tiny notepad. There are so many times when it's like I have like a great thought and I'm like, I want to write that down, but then I don't have anything on me. So it's it's great that I can, you know, go to a convenience store, which is again, super close and pick one of these up. And then it's like, okay, got an idea. Let's pull it out, boom. Oh man, and that is so easy to write on. What should I write? Um, I love Japan. I don't love China. Yeah, and I love like this kind of, you know, super like Zen minimalist aesthetic. This is what I love about Japan. Like people actually still write things. It's so cool. I, I miss that. Really. All right, so that's the video. Um, again, like I am just like blown away that you can get all this incredible stuff at any convenience store in Japan. Got the bandaid. I don't have to worry about whether I'm gonna get hurt. It's like having like a mini hospital anywhere I go. Bomb Kuhen, like again, better than the real thing. How much more praise can I give Japan? Is there anything beyond perfect? These socks. These socks, I feel like I'm riding the Nimbus, like wearing these socks. Every time I go to the convenience store and do like a haul like this, it reinforces my love for the country, my love for the people. I mean, the person at the register today, I think she was actually from Nepal. The point still stands. Look at these colors. That's what I love about Japan. You can feel like the culture and everything. And the egg sandwich and the bomb kuhen. All right, but I gotta end the video here. I, like if I get started, I can't. I feel like I'm getting like emotional. Like this is how I, I get when I talk about Japan. How did I spend 20 years of my life in this United States, you know? It's like everything back there is so stupid, so backwards. Like I hated everything in the United States. Like there's nothing good about the United States. It's just stupid. I, I don't like it um, and I don't want to go back. I really love Japan so much more. So I'm just happy to be here. Um, how about this? Can we do a big thumbs up for Japan? Thumbs if you Thumbs up if you love Japan. Give me a, a thumbs and then a sub as well. And we can do this again soon. We'll go to like a Japanese uh, grocery store, maybe like a Japanese like, um, we'll figure something out. I'm in Japan, right? Yay. Okay, so uh, I'm gonna end the video here. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it and see you again soon. All right, later. Oh, I feel like shit. Easy money. Hmm? Oh, oh, shoot. Okay. <laughs> no, no, no. Love Japan. <laughs> Love Japan. <laughs>